Hi guys, it's Jimmy McIntyre again with another quick Photoshop tutorial. Today, we're going to look at how we can very quickly and easily remove chromatic aberration from our images. In this photo, as we can see, we have a lot of chromatic aberration along the ridge here. Before we begin, I've created a free action for my newsletter subscribers, which will do all of this for you. And I'll show you how quickly it works. If we just click on the action and we have a paintbrush automatically selected and we can just paint out the chromatic aberration and we can lower the opacity of the layer until it looks nice and natural. And that's how quickly we can remove chromatic aberration. If you'd like to download this action and many other actions and my free Photoshop Easy Panel, which has a great range of luminosity masks, and detail enhancer and many other cool actions, just go to the link in the description of this video and you can download everything instantly. Now let's look at how we can remove chromatic aberration in our images. Firstly, I'll close the Easy Panel and I'm going to send this to the trash. Next, I'm just going to duplicate this layer by holding Ctrl and J or Command and J. Then I'm going to go to Filter, Blur, Gaussian Blur. And my default radius here is set at 20 pixels. If you're working with smaller images and the chromatic aberration isn't too strong, then you can work with a smaller radius of maybe 5 and 10. Just experiment to see what works for you. Now once we're ready, we just press OK and we go to the blend mode of this layer and we choose color and as we can see we've now removed the chromatic aberration but we've also affected the color in the sky and in other areas as well so i hold alt or option on a mac and i click the add a mask icon and i create a black layer mask which makes this layer invisible then with the paintbrush selected and the foreground set to white i just paint out the chromatic aberration and as I mentioned earlier, we can just lower the opacity until it looks natural. And that's it. Here's the before and after. So that's a quick and easy way of removing chromatic aberration from your images. I hope you've enjoyed the tutorial. And for more tutorials, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel.